guys, this is amazing. One life, live it. Hi guys, welcome back to Dub Ventures. If you're new to the channel, me, Brooke, Graham and Sharon and some of our friends, we're currently on the NC500 in Scotland. If you don't know what the NC500 is, it's a coastal route of about 500 miles long, going all around the beautiful parts of Scotland. Now, we're actually in the first campsite, which is Loch Lomond, Trossachs Park. If you look at our last video that we did, you'll see uh, that campsite we stayed in. Absolutely amazing, can't recommend it enough. Now what we're actually doing today, we're actually staying at this campsite for another night but today we're heading out and we're going to a place called Brecon Falls so are you ready? Let's go, it's going to be a great video this one guys so let's go to Brecon Falls So guys, <laughs> um, we're actually off to, as we've already said, Brecon Falls we're going somewhere else as well aren't we? Where's, where's it going? We're going on, it's a three-lock forest drive Sorry, just look at the views in front of us just And got there's to... one the sides and there's the yeah. Lots of cows. It's stunning around here. So yeah, we're going to uh, this place. I mean, it, you've actually like looked into this place. Yeah, we've never actually been there. here before, but it's the first one we're going to is a waterfall. It's called Brecklin Falls. And, and that's 20 minutes away from that, that campsite. campsite. There's a lot of places around near this campsite because you're in the middle of Loch Lomond. Well, yeah. Trosh Troshax, but apparently I'm saying that wrong to a lot of Scottish people. I do apologise. I'm Scottish and I don't even know how you say <laughs> it, so... The other place we're going to is called, what did I say it was called? I forgot. Three Locks. Three Locks Forest Drive. So with the word drive, it's a drive around three locks that combine, as that's what I've looked into anyway. So what um, we'll try and do is- there is a walk there as well. Yeah, I mean the weather so far um, is good, uh, it's dry. Well, apparently it's gonna it's change sunny. tonight. Yeah, it was chucking it down last night, Yeah, apparently it? it's so... gonna be like that again tonight. But as long as it's dry during the day, we don't care. Exactly. Right, so we're gonna get on the road and we'll show you guys what we get up to when we get there.
something because you're probably <laughs> going to laugh at this because I did. But I wonder what Tom's been doing. Tom! Oh, what? What's that on your butt? Yeah. Stand still. What are you about? Can you see that? What? I think. Have you fell? No, it's wet. I've been getting the footage of the waterfalls, that's what it is. <laughs> Guys, we've just found these two crazy, crazy people <laughs> that have just been swimming in that. Hey, fair play to you. You must be proper adventure seekers, so oh, yes. yeah, fair play to you. <laughs> Absolutely love it, guys. I mean, meeting them two, proper, proper cool guys. We're going to send you some stickers. I won't forget, we've got your address and everything. And, you know, but amazing people. I mean, proper adventure seekers. Crazy, but proper adventure seekers. But absolutely just love, love this, love it. Behind the scenes on dub ventures, dogs being carried past puddles. Me tiptoeing around all the money. Dogs are white dogs, you know what I mean? <laughs> Back in the van now. Any words for that day out? It was lovely. Uh, now amazing, I'm starving. amazing. We're really hungry now, so you know if you are in this area, we do suggest that you go there. It's worth it. It takes about from the car park. It takes about 15, 20 minutes walking. You know to actually but get nice to the water. Walk going yeah, it's a nice there. walk, but you know it's beautiful. Absolutely recommend it. So love it. Oh, oh. So guys, we're off back to the campsite now. So we'll see you when we get there. Right, we've had food, uh, nice and simple, toasty on the road, really simple to make, so we're just gonna chill out for a little bit now, aren't we? Aren't we, Thor? Yeah? Does that mean you want a drink? Yeah? Right, we'll get you a drink and then we're gonna chill out for a bit. Right, we've just been relaxing for a bit at this nice chilling campsite. Uh, it's raining now, but we have to take Thor for a walk and, well, we need to go to the toilet as well, don't we really? So, we do have facilities in the van, but, you know, if there's facilities here, we may as well use them. So, right, gonna take this little one for, uh, I mean, he, he's tired, isn't he? Because obviously we did that big walk earlier on, but he still has to go for his evening stroll. So we're gonna do that, and then when we get back, what we're gonna, what we're gonna try and cook? We're gonna try and cook pizza on the Ridge Monkey, so let's see how that goes. So, we'll see you back in the van. Dry and thaw. Hi. <laughs> Guys, I know we said we was cooking pizza, but there's been a slight change of plan. Do you want to tell them, Brute, why we was going to have pizza? Because Tom forgot to defrost the chicken earlier, so we thought it was still frozen. But we've just checked because we've left it out um, for a few hours, and it's actually defrosted, so. What we're actually going to do is, we're going to make a chicken curry.
uh, yeah, we've just cooked some chicken late, obviously, we've used the common sauce, but obviously when you're on the road and things like that, it's the easiest way to do it, so that's how we're doing it. I'm kind of trying to like justify uh, that it's not complete cooking. What am I doing? Just like reheating some of the... No, you cooked the chicken. No, cooked it was chicken raw, so it was cooked. Yeah, but the rice wasn't cooked and everything, but you know, it makes it easier for Nobody us. Nobody cooks rice from scratch, if well, you Well, like. anyway. But I would ideally love to be cooking this outside because I don't really want to be cooking curry in the van. It doesn't really bother me, but ideally it would be great if we was doing it outside, but it's absolutely chucking it down outside, so... Because right. we need an awning. Yeah, there we go. Group needs an awning. So many different things that we want. We've got the TV, we've got the leisure battery, and now... I wanted the want TV, an and I got the TV. And now so, you want an awning. So. And now we'll get an awning. Watch this space. Time for a chicken korma and naan bread. Right, that's us all sort of like settled down for the night now. Been and had my shower and now time for my Malibu and my movie. And what film are we watching? Olympus Has Fallen. Olympus I love has it. Fallen, so. Love it. One of my faves. Yeah. You okay, Thor? Thor's yeah. pooped. <laughs> Drinking Malibu out of a plastic, out of a plastic uh, tub. Van life, guys. Right. We'll catch up with you in the morning because we're getting an early night because we've got a long day ahead of us tomorrow. So we're going to Loch Ness. So see you in the morning, guys. Morning, guys, and uh, up oh, bright and early. Time for Brooks' morning brew. Now I'm gonna have some porridge. So got a big day ahead of us today. We're heading over to Loch Ness and we've got lots of exciting things to do up there can't wait so let's get the day started and you know what for us this is early because it's seven o'clock in the morning so let's get the day started don't try to eat your croissant <laughs> i love my croissant mm, porridge so guys that's it for today's video uh, we're heading over to loch ness now um as i've already said what a fantastic campsite this is. If you want to see more about this campsite, check out last week's video because we did a review on this campsite and absolutely amazing. Only good things to say about it. I mean, just quickly showing you like the views all over there and everything. I mean, it's a bit cloudy today, so, and it's very, very rainy as well. So we've got the van packed, all ready to go and everything. We've got Graham and Sharon over there giving us a thumbs up, all ready to go. So if you are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. We're heading over to Loch Ness and basically when we get from there onwards, that's when the real like, NC500 route starts. So really looking forward to it. So don't forget to subscribe until the next video. Bye for now.